I think you mentioned in the docu series that you pray for everybody at night. You pray for everyone. Um, does that include, you know, people who you've crossed paths with, such as Richard, or just people like that in general? Every night or every morning. If I'm too tired when I go to bed, because I'll fall asleep when I'm praying. Well, whenever so you pray in general, yeah. I guess, yeah. Yeah, but uh, every day, I do, and in the end. I add on, uh, and one more thing, because by this time now, I'm just talking to him, and I said, I'd like to add, uh, pray for the soul, and Richard's one of the guys that I pray for his soul, and the other one is Charlie Manson. I mean, these are two of the most vile men in the world in existence, and I wanted no sympathy for them, and if they got murdered in prison or if they got sentenced to death and executed so be it you know i have no control all i do is my job and once it gets to that point my job is done i don't i don't really care when i told the director he was kind of shocked that i went through all of this and all the all the devastation that he that he caused and yet i found it in my heart to say a prayer and he says i've got to ask you why and i said you know Someone once said that the good Lord is all forgiving. I said, uh, I understand. I'm not forgiving of the man, but uh, if anybody needs help, he does. Ain't nobody else going to pray for that man. And so I just want, want the good Lord to know that I'm praying for his soul. Now it's out of my hands. Whether he wants to save that soul or not, you know, that's not up to me. I, I just say a prayer for his soul because I know Nobody else's, other than his family, maybe. Right. 